Science and the Richness of Nature. The area where the latest technologies unite with traditional culture. The place where both a public research institution and a private enterprise tackle research. It is a city where Japanese people and foreigners live together as good friends. In Scuba Science City, a person's mind can link to technology. It takes just 45 minutes from Tokyo. Scuba Science City is located at the foot of beautiful Mount Scuba in Scuba City, Ibaraki Prefecture. In order that many foreign scientists and their families attend an international research conference, they visit the Scuba Science City. Only 50 kilometers from the capital Tokyo, it's linked by the Tsukuba Express train which connects from Tokyo directly and the Joban Highway by car. Service is available from Tokyo International Airport and Narita International Airport. It's also close to the Ibaraki Airport, which opened in 2010. And so access by plane is also convenient. From Ibaraki Airport to Scuba City takes about one hour by car. Since the opening of the Metropolitan Intercity Expressway, it takes only 50 minutes from Narita International Airport to the Tsukuba Science City. In areas along the Tsukuba Express's railroad line that includes Tsukuba Science City, new development is planned. Moria Station, where convenience and traditional culture coexist. Mirai Daira Station is the gateway for you to enjoy a healthy country life with a good environment. Midorino Station, it's a country-style city to lead the way of life for living space of the 21st century. Bampaku Kinen Koen Station is a central city of communication to people, goods and nature. Kenkyu Gakuen Station is a newly emerging city center in the science and technology city of Tsukuba. Tsukuba Station. This is the central part of Science City. Tsukuba is the greatest international R&D center in Japan. This is the gate of science. Many iron balls are hanging. This is the famous Galileo. Here we can see more famous people who led the progress of science, such as Edison, Newton, and Archimedes. This gate of science was made at the time of the Scuba Expo 85. In 1985, the International Exposition was held in Scuba. As the center of technology representing Japan, the name of Scuba became well known to the world. Construction of Scuba Science City 
was approved as a national project in 1963. Now about 30% of the research institutions of the Japanese government are located there. Many research institutions and companies are represented and 20,000 scientists are engaged in research and development. There are also 5,000 foreign experts among them. Let's take a look at the major research institutions. The National Institute of Advanced Industrial Science and Technology is one of the largest public research organizations in Japan. The leading edge R&D facilities such as the Super Clean Room are located here. One technology being developed here is the study of humanoid robots. With the Centre National de la Recherche Scientifique of France, international joint research are being performed. Cameras are attached to the humanoid robot walking with two legs. You can control the robot by watching arrows projected on a monitor. The equipment on the head has detected the signal transmitted to your brain from your eyes, and it has indicated to the robot the direction to go. The research of AIST has created the future of One Step Beyond, where everyone lives easily. The National Institute for Material Science, or NIMS. This research focuses on fuel cell material, The thin film of a highly efficient fuel cell is made using this equipment. The fuel cell is attracting attention as a next generation energy, which does not produce CO2. If production of an energy efficient fuel cell is possible, the material cost will also be reduced and it will be able to benefit society. At NIMS, research and development of a new material with low environmental impact are performed, aiming at creating a sustainable society. The KEK High Energy Accelerator Research Organization is a laboratory that uses a large-scale facility called an accelerator. This accelerator, three kilometers in circumference, makes an electron beam and a positron beam circulate in opposite directions at almost the speed of light creating high-energy collisions to study the beginning of the universe. The collisions occur in this building. The bell detector measures the particles created in the collisions. By analyzing high-energy collisions, Researchers confirm the Kobashi Matsukawa theory, a clue to solving one of the mysteries of the Big Bang. The experiments performed here contributed to the Nobel Prize for Physics for Professors Matsukawa and Kobashi.
KEK also develops advanced accelerator technologies for future research. They are developing a smaller beam down to the size of a nanometer and precisely controlling this high quality beam. There is another large-scale accelerator institution located in Tokaimura, which is also in Ibaraki Prefecture. It is known as J-Park, which the Japan Atomic Energy Agency and KEK manage together. World-class high-intensity proton beams are produced through accelerators. Various experiments are conducted there using secondary particles, such as neutrons, which are generated by collisions between a proton and a target material. Ibaraki Prefecture has constructed two beam lines there for a private company and encouraged the use of neutrons by the industry. An object can be studied on the atomic and molecular level by produced secondary particles such as muon and neutron. This research leads to development of new medical supplies by testing on an atomic level how proteins which make up our bodies and medicines act on our bodies. At Scuba Science City, nine industrial complexes are ready for use. In this natural environment surrounded with greenery, many companies are working on leading research. At Scuba, venture businesses number over 200. The robot suite HAL, which was developed by Cyberdyne Incorporated, is worn by people whose muscular power has declined due to injury. Recovery through rehabilitation is the goal. The Scuba Center Incorporated serves as a supporter of venture business training. It was established by Ibaraki Prefecture and private enterprises. The offices, including a regular laboratory, can be rented individually. In Scuba Science City, Research institutions, companies, and the municipality help each other to create new industry and cutting-edge technology.